away from a garland. Yeah. Uh, as you may be able to tell, this is my sister, Julia Hart. Yes. Much, much younger sister. <laughs> the only reason I'm here is because if I don't speak and say something nice about Saul, he will never forgive me, and I will hear about it every time I see him. Like, you know, Zach talked about me, but what about you? Uh, no, actually, the, so I did not plan anything like for flaws and stuff because, of course, Saul has no flaws in my eyes. But there are two things I want to say about Saul, and I actually am going to be nice. Um, oh. That's a first. Yes, I am. Um, just to give an idea of how much Saul means to us, Holly and I got married two years ago after how many years? Woo! Wow. How many years? Uh, 22 years of engagement. And... Um, there was just one person that we thought of that could be our rabbi, officiant, priest, Canadian, uh, Canadian. <laughs> um, and that was Saul. And the reason we chose Saul to, to do this honor for us was because of what he has meant to our family. And he has, he has brought this Episcopal Rancho Santa Fe, uh, waspy, <laughs> unemotional, very cautious group of people, which is only the two of us now, but um, into this Canadian Jewish family that we love and adore, and we love his kids and grandkids, and, and um, it is so wonderful. I've, you know, always you know, wondered what my sister would bring to the family, because, you know, but she brought Saul. And, and Saul has made us all a family of Canadian Jews, and we adore him for that. Um, and the last thing I want to say, it's just, I, I thought of this, I because I'm now 55, and I don't remember things, and apparently I'm second in the age thing, I don't remember who I said this to, but I said something, I described Saul to somebody the other day, and I said, it was somebody who knew you, and I don't know why I don't remember, but I said, he is the kindest and most warm-hearted person I have ever known, and that's how I feel. Oh. Oh.